Another day, another day. Shepherd's pie, twice baked potatoes. Let me show you how we make these in our house. And if you don't like it, you already know, bitch, don't bite it. This is the meat we're using because it's cheap. I'm cheap and it goes a long way. Wash, fry, stab your dingle hopper in. Some olive oil, sprinkle on some salt, pepper. Throw them in the oven on 350 for about an hour. These are the potatoes I'm using. They're not Yukon, but they're golden. And try to keep them the same size. Throw them in your pot, hit it with that salt. We'll throw in some garlic clove, cover with water. Throw them on the stove, bring them to a broil and let them simmer for about 30 minutes. Grab your onion goggles, one lash left, standing 3,000. Let's cut an onion. Chop up some celery, chop up some carrots. Go ahead and drain your potatoes and let them sit for five minutes. Mash potatoes how I make them. Throw in your cooled down potatoes, mash them up. Get you a pot, throw some butter in, single hopper of garlic or two and melt it down, 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 or whatever Beyonce said. Some chives, melt that down a little bit. Throw in your butter. I literally cut this whole part out. I put some heavy cream, measure with the goggles. We got some Parmesan, I lost the nail. Shitload of pepper, cause we like a lot. A little bit of salt and a little bit of paprika, fuck. Grab your pan, let's start our shepherd's pie. We'll start off with some oil, corn, onion, carrot, and celery. Throw it in the pan. Dingle hopper of garlic, throw your meat in. I already cooked the meat. Dingle hopper of flour, dingle hopper of tomato paste. A little more than dingle hopper. Some rosemary, no jane. Take all the time you need. Knock, knock, come in. Throw your soul in there. Seasoned pepper. Plenty of wash that ass in the shower sauce. Red wine and vinegar. Dingle hopper of this beef paste. Bro, I got some wash that ass in the shower sauce on my white shirt. Now we're gonna hit it with some beef broth. Cook it down a little bit and then we're gonna add some frozen peas. Whatever peas you wanna add, don't come from my great value unless you got a greater value. Don't cook it all the way down, you want some of that gravy in there. I forgot to push record, but I cut the top off the potatoes and dug the inside out. Now I have the cutest little potato boats. Take some of the good stuff and we're gonna shove it right in the middle. Y'all boy, four cheese Mexican, I'm gonna put it right on top. Now we're gonna throw our mashed potatoes right on top of the cheese. Fancy. What's even fancier? A little more cheese. Hit it with a little seasoned pepper. Everything's cooked, so throw them back in the oven on 350 so they can warm up and brown up a little bit. Boom, they're sizzling. Yeah, boy. Oh, yeah. She. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God.